The machine is operated by a token. It's a coin that looks very much like a pound coin. So we'll be providing service users with tokens at point of entry. So at that point, they have an understanding that we know the machine is there, we know the machine will be used, and we all know what's inside the machine. We're not encouraging drug use because the stuff that we are, or the items that we are supplying are freely available for any NHS or there's many, many chemists as well. What we're providing is a pathway to infection control um, and also a pathway to recovery as well. In addition to that as well, it's also let us be able to provide naloxone, prescribe naloxone, which is a life-saving drug also, so that um, if a service user is about to overdose, then we are able to inject naloxone and reverse the effects of overdose temporarily until uh, you have um, emergency services turning up. We've had mixed reactions, but the machine has been used. Service users will say that it's something that is maybe a bit embarrassing, um, but other service users will welcome it. You will often get service users who are referred to us who have been who have been booked out of other accommodation services because they have used drugs and that they can bounce around homeless accommodation services. So if we can provide provide them with somewhere where they can make a disclosure without the fear of being booked out, then that will only lead to recovery.